Hello everyone, this is Lillian and it's time for our three minutes with the Word Audio Devotional. Today's topic is Give Thanks and our anchor scripture is taken from the book of Psalms chapter 50 verses 14 and 15. Make thankfulness your sacrifice to God and keep the vows you made to the Most High. Then call on me when you are in trouble and I will rescue you and you will give me glory. Today I bring you a short and simple charge. Be thankful to God and vocalize these thanks. As simple as this sounds, many of us do not give God enough thanks. You see, when you see people who are chronic thankers, the tendency is to think that they have better lives than you do. The truth is they most likely do not. They may have just mastered the very beneficial posture of giving God thanks irrespective of what's going on for them. Have you ever been around people who just complain and complain and complain? They complain about the government. They complain about the systems. They complain about their homes. They complain about medical services. They complain about education. They complain about their health. They complain about the financial situation of their country. They just turn up their noses at everything and everyone. I find people like this really draining. But I digress. If you read the whole of Psalms 50, you will see that what God is saying in essence is this. There are many things you give me. You give me bulls, rams, fat offerings and the like. All these are good, but what I really want is your thanks. There is something about giving a person what he wants. Even as I speak my, about this, my heart has traveled down to the book of Genesis where Isaac said to Esau, go and prepare me something that I love that I may give you the blessing. That instruction to Esau was deep intelligence. Isaac set the examination and gave Esau the answer. If you do this, my heart will be glad and I will bless you. Look at Psalms 50 again. If you give me thanks, my heart will be glad, the Lord is saying. And when the day of trouble comes, you can count on me. God desires your thanks. Some of us need to repent of complaining and moaning and telling ourselves that we are being real and factual. We need to intentionally start saying thank you to the Lord. The songwriter says, count your blessings, name them one by one, and it will surprise you what the Lord has done. That place you are moaning about is another person's dream. And even if it wasn't, if the master says we should thank him, the truth is we don't need a reason to. We thank because our master has said it. Take a few minutes to lavish God with thanks this morning. Let us pray. Father, in the name of Jesus, thank you for your word this morning. Thank you for who you are. Thank you for how you love us. Thank you for Jesus. Thank you for everything. Let the spirit or the song of thanksgiving never depart from our mouths and continue to take all the glory of mighty God. In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. Speak to you again soon. If you are blessed, please drop me a line on audiodevotional at yahoo.com or on our website at www.3minutesaudiodevotional.com. You could also follow us on Facebook, Instagram, YouTube and Twitter at 3 Minutes Audio Devotional. Remember, wrapped up in God's word is all you need for your change to come. Love you and bye.